Welcome back to the 8-Bit Challenge. This is episode 103, coming back off of the 100 special, which went across the two episodes. And uh, what can I say about the last challenge? Well, uh, Mutant Cowpella did very well in uh, A Day in the Life of Sir Clive Sinclair. And he beat me fair and square. He played very, very well. And Smugness Alert was toned down quite a lot to the point that I was willing for him to complete the game, actually. Yes, I was indeed. Um, on the other hand, that was episode 102B. Uh, uh, let's get on with this game anyway. Uh, it's uh, hang on, keyboard. There we go. Um, and um, Novabug, who took part in episode 102A, didn't fare quite so good at it, but he gave it his all. And uh, at the same time, being an Amstrad lover, swallowed his pride and said quite a few no nice things about um, the late Sir Clive Sinclair. So it was all good all round. Um, the only thing is, unfortunately. Chris obviously misunderstood the uh, the episodes as far as uh, putting a game down, so which means he didn't put another challenge down. So in other words, I gave him an Ian two, and from Ian uh, from Chris Overbug, and he received one in return. Well, we had a quick chat about that, and he's going to put up two challenge video games, or shall I say, two games to be challenged in the same video when he hopefully comes back for the 110th. So anyway, there we go. Um, but yes, Ian did very well. Beat me at this game, uh, at uh, A Day in a Life, which as I said, can be found in episode 102A, played very, uh, 102B, played very well. So fair enough, can't complain that. So now I'm back to being two behind. And his response to me is he's given me this game called um, Coracle. Which is a, a nice little homebrew game. Came out about 2011. Something like that, buddy. I was 10 years ago already. The idea is you're controlling this little boat with uh, a very flippy floppy extended looking dodgy penis shaped thing. Um, and you, you've got to, first of all, you've got to raise the water. And to do that, you have to shoot the clouds, which I just did. And as you can see, the, the water has now risen to the uh, two thirds of the screen. Once that happens, the fish and other marine wildlife wants to come back. And the only way to do that is shoot these bubbles and catch them. But that's easier said than done. There's a plus there for extra bullets, and I just, I think I caught it. Yep, yeah, there you go, extra balls. But it can be tricky because you can't go left and you can't go right with your boat. You can shoot left and you can shoot right. So you're basically at the whim of the torrents of the currents, I should say, of this ocean. So it's all about timing. There's no point in me shooting that. Shoot it now, so if I bounce back off the screen, I can collect one anyway. So yeah, you've got to collect 16 fish type things. So you see, I've got about another five to collect, and then you've, yes, hurry up, and then you complete the level. And I've worked out I've got to beat Mutant Caterpillar's score, well, his screen, I've worked it out that he got to screen level six. As you can see, there's no level indicator, so this is where it gets tricky. I've had some word with him about this. It's not easy to do levels on games when it doesn't show you the levels, especially when each level looks the same. So you have to watch the entire video again and again and work out what the what level he got to. But anyway, got to screen six, and I've got to beat a score of... I'll tell you in a minute, because I don't want to take my eyes off the screen. Just try and do this level first, and then I can tell you the score I got to beat. See if I shoot that one. Yeah, no. No. Oh. Got that one. These two could be good. Yes, go on. One more. I want one more fishy. No, too far. Shoot those over there. No, I don't want that. Oh, I didn't get it anyway. Here we go. This has got to be it. There we go. Level done. I've got to beat a score of 37,530, but I've got to get to level 6 first, and this is level 2 coming up. Bonus awarded. Now, like Ian, I don't understand this either, so I'm just going to let it do its thing. 200, 200. There you go. I have no idea what to do there. Yeah, anyway. See, look, you've got to shoot these clouds. You must not shoot the aeroplanes, because that sends the water back down. So, you've got to 
just basically shoot the clouds and shoot the bubbles. Do not shoot anything else like the um, like the aeroplanes and later on there'll be rubbish coming down like apple corks and all sorts of other stuff. And later on you'll have, here's an apple cork, look. So you've got to shoot them, don't let them land in the water. And later on there'll be ducks as well that um, swim along. So you've got to shoot them as well, which I feel a bit bad about doing because I like ducks. I'm not a bird person at all, never have been. You know, I just, um, more wild birds anyway, um, they're just, well, they're just shit machines really, aren't they? They just crap everywhere, all over the road, the paths, your car, your laundry, just, and your windows of your house or wherever you live in. So, um, I don't see any bloody use for them really. And on top of that, they wake you up at four, three thirty, four o'clock in the bloody morning. So is there anything positive about these things? Birds? I don't know. Anyway that's another subject so now look I've got the water levels right so now the bubbles appear I've got to shoot these I, I, I say it's, it's not a bad game but it, to me I find it a little bit boring after a while it's not easy on later levels that's for sure oh bonuses bonuses do I get some, got some extra balls um, yeah I think it's because I don't know it's, it's white blue and cyan boring colors nothing much going on as far as music it's a kind of it is what it is game it reminds me a bit of the um the is what it is homebrew game that i gave in which was uh scuttlebutt that was in several episodes ago come on where's all the bubbles Playing this on my 128k toast rack, if uh, you want to know, but I'm pretty sure most of you who follow my channel would know that. I do not use emulators on my 8-bit computers, on my 8-bit footage, where possible. Now and then I have to, oh, there's a cork, gotcha. Come on, come on, that was good, catch them. Yeah, lovely, and that one, good. Oh no, what went in the water? It sunk my water down. That's it. Do not shoot the planes. There's an apple core. Get rid of you. Hurry up again. Yes, I know. Another apple core. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Oh! And I've missed that. Time running out. This looks better. That looks good. Yes, that looks good. Catch them. So I still need six bits and my time's getting low. Right. Shoot now. Shoot, 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 catch, catch, I missed a lot, look at this I've missed, oh bloody hell, extra, extra balls, you don't get any icons for extra time though I don't think, maybe you do, I don't know, I haven't really looked at him, oh this looks good, this looks good, level done, cool, level three now, how did you do? No bonus. Great. Now, level three, and I've just realized, I forgot about this. There is an extra two controls up and down. Up, I've shot a plane, makes no difference because the water level's low anyway. Um, up makes your boat go faster and down slows it, slows your boat. So you be easier to catch the, um, the icons, I say, the fish. <clears throat> That's it. Clouds, lots of water. We want. Don't shoot the planes. And there's an apple core. Good shot, Zeus. Good shot. Godly shot, that was. Good girl. Let's give it you. Oh, my bullets are getting a bit low. I could do some extra bullets. That should be it. Yes, here we go. Apple core. Apple core. Shoot, shoot. Oh, I'm missing them all. This is careless. And my bullets are running out. I need more balls. Look at this. I'm missing all of them. Oh. 27. I need more balls. Got one lot. Wow, whoopee do. 
No, there's no point shooting that, is it? Ah, shoot it now. Oh, that's what I want. Yay, good. Whoa, that was close. Oh, apple bloody core. I think that's if it is an apple core, is it? No, I, was, I shouldn't have shot them. I need to time this right. Oh, bloody hell. Oh, go away. Shoot now. That's it. Oh, go on. Slow. Oh, damn it. Come on. Get these things. Oh, shoot, shoot, shoot. My time's getting lower and lower. It's getting lower and lower. That's it. Oh, 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 oh. Hurry up, it says bloody hell, I've got all these, that shit, shoot, 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 that's it, that's it, that looks good, that's better. Ooh. I don't know, as I said, I don't know if you can get better time. Oh, my water's going down. Got to do all this again. Don't shoot that. Give me the bullets. Extra balls, just what I wanted. Shoot, shoot. Should get that one. There we go. That's good. Oh dear. Yes, yeah, it's, it's a frustrating game as well, I will say. That's it. Come on, collect them. I've got one. Come on, Daz, this is a lousy performance. What are you taking so long? That looks good. Grab them. Yes, lovely. Oh, the time's getting low. I don't want to repeat this level. Oh, that looks perfect. Go on. Oh, <laughs> God, did I make a mountain out of my way well that level. <sighs> Ridiculous. Yeah. Come on, level four. Right. Now I'm going to start using this bloody speed up and slow down thing a bit better. But first of all, let's get the let's get the clouds. I need bullets. I need bullets. They're running out. There's the bullets go forward. There we go. Press it up. I've zoomed. Just got them. Lovely. Get rid of you. That's good. Keep shooting. The, keep shooting the clouds. Don't shoot the bloody planes. Oh, that was close. I shouldn't have took that shot there. Shoot. There we go. Bang, 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 bang. Missed. Right, I missed again. Bang. Oh, you little. That's what I want. Quick, forward, slow, down. Gotcha. Right. Apple core. I don't want you either. Don't shoot the planes. Good shot. Good shooting, Tex. Right now. Slow down, slow down, speed up. Oh, you bugger. Speed up, shoot. That's it, shoot, shoot, shoot. Good. Shoot them, good. That's it, slow. And that one's slow, shoot them. Uh, that's it. Good. Oh, could do with them. Good. That's it. Getting a good stock of balls now. See, the speed up and slow down is very useful. Here we go. Balls. 
slow down, shoot, slow down. I am hurrying fast. So yeah, you can't go left or right. You're constantly going against the um, currents. One more, come on. That's it. I've got him. Brilliant. I collect them as well. Excellent. Excellent. Oh. No bonus again. Right, level five. Yeah, I played this a, f a few years ago, actually. Uploaded footage on my channel. There's the ducks. I don't like shooting ducks. And, uh, yeah, I was quite surprised you picked this. I never thought, you know, with all the zillions of games, uh, you picked this one. But I need to... That's it, good. I need to keep on this tail. You have to shoot them, otherwise uh, you lose a life. Oh, damn it. Good. Yeah, good. Boom, got you. Oh, don't. Risky. Yeah, right. You. I'll go away. Right, that should be it now. I should be getting... Yeah, here we go. Now's the time to collect. Oh, bloody hell. I didn't want... No, I want the... Oh, for Christ's sake. Ugh. <laughs> it can get frustrating. That's it. Come on, build the water up again. Should be it again now. Oh, just got that in time. That's it, slow, slow. I don't like it when it does that. Got you. Come on. Gotta get these bloody things, I mean, yes. That's good. Slow. Slow, just gonna miss that one. Oh. Oh. All oh, these apple cores are so annoying. Who's throwing these things down? Gotcha. Yeah, I thought I was going to lose you then. Oh, I still need quite a few. Come on, that's it. Slow. Good. Oh, yes, that's perfect. Line them up. Lovely. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, you git. Uh, right on the edge like that, you can't get them. One more. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Hey, level... F Level four. I couldn't. I didn't think I would do that. Actually, uh, uh. now I think. I think this is his level. I'm pretty sure it is. So if I could just do this level, which. Um, yeah, it's going to be bloody rock hard now. But this is the sort of game you can point harvest while I've been trying. And we had this little chat. I just, you know, I just, it's not the best game for scoring or level, really. Let's 
So I'm going to try and just score as much as I can. I've still got three lives. I haven't lost life yet. The ducks are coming thick and fast this time. Careful. Good. Oh no. Good. Getting that bomb. See, look at all this now. Bloody hell. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. Freak's sake. The bomb just destroys everything. I've got to start right from the start again. I'm never going to do this level now. There's not enough time. I'm just going to have to play it out and try and score as much as I can. I've still got a long way to go for the score. About six, seven thousand behind him. Bullets could do with that. Fast, slow, gotcha. Yep, I do. Thank you. Oh, didn't hit that sack quick enough, did I? Nah, this this level this level is literally let's just get points now. Can't do anything about this. I'm never going to complete this level. Not this life, anyway. God, it's so low, the points, though. It takes ages to build them up. Screw it. There we go. Boom, the bomb. That does the worst. Just, yeah, start right from the start again. Boom. <clears throat> yeah, it becomes, I don't know. Um, I just find it a little bit, a little bit dull. You know, levels all look the same. But it's, it's, it's a homebrew game, isn't it? It's just a simple homebrew game. Not bomb this time. No. Ooh. That's it. Good. That's it. Good. Good. That's it. Time's just about to go out. Time out, there we go. That's first life. First life lost. Just whack some more points there, we go. Right. <clears throat> Try again. I need 5,000 points. And that's a lot, considering you only get about bloody 30 points for every time you shoot a cloud. Or the duck gets you points, but the, the rubbish, I don't think, gets you anything, like the bags and so on. I didn't see that. The clouds do, about 30 points each. But yeah, shooting the rubbish gets you nothing. Yeah, just going back to A Day in the Life of Sir Clive Sinclair. Um, what coincidence, there's a game I pick, and two weeks later he dies. Creepy, really, in a way. I mean, what are the odds? A hundred games so far, plus picked. I pick a game where the creator of the ZX Spectrum. Um, it's a game, a game about him. And two weeks later, the actual Sir Clive dies himself Re in real life. It's just, uh, yeah. So it was meant to be, really. But yeah, he played very well on that. Made it look easy. Give me an incentive now to um, to try and complete it myself. It's just a good, I have problems remembering where bloody Sir Clive appears though on each level. Oh, it slow down. That's oh, nearly collided into that, and that's it. I've lost the bloody. Uh. Yeah. Um, get to a level, and I can't remember where Sir Clive appears on that level, and then I I lose the pattern. 
but I'll get there. All games click after a while, one way or another. You know what, I'm getting close to his score, you know. I've just seen that. Um, yeah, I'm on his level. Oh, it's just so plain. Nice shot, Darren. At least you don't get uh, points taken off. And another one. You didn't get any points for that. Any clouds. But this is definitely his level he got to. Hurry up. I haven't even got a single fish yet. Hurry up, it says. Can I get some? Eee, I've got one. <laughs> Let's get some bullets while I'm at it. Balls. Let's see a few more. Duck. Duck. Sit. A couple more of them. Oh, it's bloody taking all my flipping fish in that away. You know what? I think I've beaten. I didn't quite start that down. Is that 36,038? I, I can't take my eyes off the screen at the minute. I'm just trying to gauge all the points I can. I think that's 38,000, isn't it? Th 39,000. I've beaten him. Gotcha. That's the same screen. Time up. Level lost. Uh, yeah, level and life lost. Last one. That's it. I've definitely won it, so I'm just going to shoot all over the place. I don't care now. Screw it. That's definitely screen six, which is what I got to, and he got 37,000, and I'm just clocking up about 40,000 now. So yes, that comes to me. That means um, I'm just one behind again. Good. Yeah, it's an okay game. Not really. Uh, I think it was more rage for me in this game than anything else. Shooting his wreck at the points. Yeah, I've, def I've, def I've had him. I've got him. But no smugness from me. That's it. Simple. I beat you. Thank you very much. That's it. Yeah, well, come on. I might as well just kill myself off, Darren. This is what I'm putting, you know, I'm not going to do this level anyway. Happy for to just die yeah, somehow. Yes, uh, I wonder what game I'm going to give you next. We'll have to have a look, won't we? Stay tuned, everybody, in the next minute or so, and we'll find out. I've got an urge to pick a game that I've challenged the previous challenger at Novabug some time ago. Yeah, I've got an urge to pick a game that um, that I lost. Sourly so. There we go. That's it, isn't it? And hopefully do better this time. But we'll find out what that is in a minute. Is that it? Game over. There we go. Uh, um, is it going to be three letter? Oh no, I could do Zeus. Screw it. All right. Zeus. E. Thank you. And you. No, 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 not T. Back. U. S. Zeus. There we go. 42,500, level six. Yes, I've won that one. 
that's Coracle on the ZX Spectrum. Enough about that, let's get on with the next challenge. As I said, I've got an urge to pick a game that I've played on the 8-bit challenge before, many, many episodes ago. Um, and, um, yeah, there's two actually I've got in mind, but which one it is, I don't know yet. We'll find out in a second. There's one I lost and one I won. But it'll be interested to see what uh, you make of it. So, um, yeah, there's no time like the present. Let's get on with it. Let's see what your next challenge on the 8-bit challenge is. Take it away, Zeus. Welcome to your new challenge, mate. Rambo 2 on the Commodore 64, and this is going to be a, uh, a time run. See how quick you can complete the game. And that's it. There are a couple of other steps. Let's get my name in. The first one is you must go through the front gate of the camp, not the rear, because I think it's might. I'm not sure it could be the same time, but we're going to stick to the same deal. Go through the front gate. You'll see what I mean when I play. Start playing this, and you also have to let the uh, the music interludes between the stages play in their entirety. You cannot just simply uh, press fire. You'll gain seconds of time that way, and that's not allowed. So, got to go through the front gate and play the music. I let the music play between each of the levels. Uh, come on, let's just get on with it. And you'll see what I mean when it comes to the front gate. Uh, you can either go left, but you go right like this. You'll, you'll see what I mean in a second. Um, but yeah, that's it, ready. Just complete the game as quickly as possible. I have got my big clock right next to my uh, big stopwatch, I say on my mobile phone, ticking away now, right next to my toast rack. So I can even see it almost in the corner of my eye. But yeah, there's three stages, or maybe four, I can't remember. But only one loop. Complete the game as quickly as possible. So the timer starts the moment the, uh, you see your player on the screen to the moment you land the chopper at the end of the game. Just like that there. It's awkward to reach over to the keyboard and press adjust the uh, um, change your weapon. But yeah, that's it really. Uh, there's nothing else. There's no other steps. Just make sure the tune, as you'll find out in a second. Right, there you go. That's the first tune. So you can press fire and skip that and go straight to game. You can't do that. Just allow it to play its tune. Let it do its own thing. The next stage will automatically start. And then you've got to fly down your chopper, land it, rescue the other hostages, and then get out back to the chopper and um yeah and uh what's it called escape the gunships and land your craft in the barracks and that's it very 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 short game uh sort of three to four minutes long it's nothing but the soundtrack is great as we said come on you two hurry up go that's it straight ahead Doom, 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 boom, 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 boom. Right. Come on. That's it. That's the weapon I want. And this is the last part of the game. So, yeah, there's no. Unlike Agent X2, which you complained about, there's no. Um, what's it called? Uh, everything's the same. The layouts are the same, the paths are the same, the music interludes are the same. There's no randomness about it. So you just got to try and beat my uh, speed. Oh, okay. boom, no, boom, no, boom, gotcha. Can be a bugger. That's pretty good, actually. He's, um, he took a little bit of energy from me. Yeah, so, how well are you going to do at this? Very short game. Oh, God. Come on, there, good. Yeah, so uh, front gate, let the music play, and that's it really. And we are coming into land, 58, 2, 2. Whoa, I broke the three minute barrier. Two minutes, 59 seconds. How about that? And the world record is actually quicker than that. So it is possible to beat. No, I'm just gonna let it run, and we're gonna get mugged here. This is a, a game for serious point harvesting. But this game is if it was designed for you to be killed straight, you've got to just keep going, keep forcing your way, run, 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 run. So it literally is built for speed runs, really, this game. But there you go. Um, 
152 seconds. No, what's the point? The score don't mean nothing. You've got to beat two minutes, 59 seconds to uh, to beat me. If you manage to get 259, then it is a draw. We're not going to go with score because um, you can score so much in this. It's, it's utterly pointless. So forget that score. It's a time run from the moment you start looking at the screen, from the moment your player appears on the screen to the moment you land your chopper at the end and the sign comes up saying congratulations there, you know, uh, that's when you take your time. And I have got it clocked at 2 minutes 59, well, 0.27 if you want to be that precise. But, you know, if we're going to hundredths, that's ridiculous. We'll just say... Uh, 259. Wow, I've done a, I've done a few I've done a few several actually 301 runs. Um, I've never clocked t uh, three minutes before, so it's 259. Yeah, I might enter that in the uh, speed run. I don't know if I come first now. As I said, the world record is a little a uh, couple of seconds faster now. I think. But yeah, I'm proud of that. So no randomness in that, in that whatsoever. Everything is the same. So I don't want to hear in it. Just see what you can do. And uh, yeah, it's a case of a bit like Dragster beat me on a time run, on a timer. And so far, I think I'm pretty much undefeated, aren't I, on timers? I've beaten at Dragster, Agent X2, but you kicked up a stink about that, but nonetheless, I still want that one. And here we have another time run, Rambo 2 on the Commodore 64. So let's see uh, what you can do with that, mate. All right. Looking forward to seeing what you've got for me next time and thanks everyone else for joining me on this edition of the 8-Bit Challenge. Please make sure you subscribe to my opponent just to make sure that you get the notification when the next challenge video will be up. It could be anything up to three weeks time. So you might pump it out in three days, could be three weeks, but it's not going to be longer than three weeks either. Alright, thanks very much again. Until next time, until the next 8-Bit Challenge anyway, all the best, take care of yourselves. Happy gaming. Zeus out.